Well, I already caught one. I'll throw up a picture of it on the screen. I didn't even have my camera on. I was waiting on Daniel to get his stuff together and caught one real fast on this Ned rig. Oh, there's a small one right there. Look at that little, little rock bass. Cast right up in there and let it, the current bring it down along that rock. Ah. I had one. You have one. I did. I didn't set the hook. Oh man. Rhino Joe. I'd say the more we get away from where everybody goes, the more chance we'll have. <laughs> Another little rock bass. These are, if you can catch one that's big enough, these are actually decent eating. Going the wrong way, dude. Ah, son of a pickle, man. Man, there's rock bass all up in there, man. Huh? Little rock bass. No, I caught one. There's a bunch of them over there, though. <laughs> I would try one of those little, yeah, you might catch it on that. Catch what? Rock bass or what, a smallmouth? Trout, man. Got whole trout set up. Yep, <laughs> little rock bass. Oh, that's a little smallmouth. Small there you go. Gave him a good old kiss. <laughs> Hashtag me too. Ah, broke off. Son of a pickle, man. Well, I, I decided to use six pound fluorocarbon because this water is so clear and i knew i probably i'm gonna have to retie more so i was fishing with that ned rig um, but now i'm gonna do these still ned rig but with this trd crawls there's a lot of these little crawfish and they are right about this size in here I think that'll do a good job. Let's get this tied on and get back to fishing. We need, we need like the deeper pools with the water coming in because they'll sit in those deeper pools when they rest yeah. and then they'll pull up like. like How are you all doing? Yeah. I, I mean, since we've had a, a good several days of rain, or like, yeah, you can tell by looking at the rocks that this was underwater. Like, being deep down here, definitely be deep down the blue hole. Well, I mean, there are some really deep spots, but. We'd probably get all the way down there and it'd be dried up too. If it's dried up down there. Dried up everywhere. It's a long walk. 
Let's walk down that way. Past all these swimmers. I don't want to catch one of them. I don't want to catch a swimmer. I already got enough kids. I don't need to catch any toddlers. Well, overall I had a great time down there on Otter Creek. The water was super low. We've not had very significant rain in a long time as you heard us talking about. Um, but unfortunately some rain rolled in and it was some pretty bad storms. So we headed out, went and grabbed some to eat, got some Chinese food and then as you can tell, I wore Daniel out out there. But um, as always, guys, I appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget, get outside, do something awesome, take somebody with you to get a chance, and I'll see you in the next video.